It's a real pleasure to, to welcome you, and I, and I must tell you, you have a you know a fascinating portfolio, uh, and uh, you've uh, you've had a chance, uh, I'm sure, to find out more about our uh, um, ambitious uh, plans uh, uh, on all topics that are uh, relevant uh, to the file that uh, that you cover. I just wanted to let you know that uh, you know we are um, totally committed um, to making the green transition work. Um, for everyone uh, in Greece. Uh, I think we have a very bold but uh, uh, realistic agenda when it comes uh, to these um, uh, topics. Uh, and we're looking forward to working um, uh, with the Commission uh, using the funds from the Recovery and Resilience uh, uh, Plan uh, to make the green transition a reality, but also to create lots of jobs uh, in the process. I think we can really convincingly uh, make uh, uh, make the case that protecting our uh, uh, our environment, uh, enhancing uh, biodiversity, is uh, at, at least in the case of Greece, not just a, a must uh, from an ecological point of view, but the obvious choice from an economic uh, point of view. Uh, and we're very much looking forward, uh, you know, discussing these issues. There are also some issues which are um, uh, sensitive to us. Uh, regarding fisheries and, and illegal fishing within uh, within our territorial waters. I'm also very um, um, uh, interested to hear your opinions on these issues. So first of all, of course, uh, thank you very much. Uh, I'm very delighted and honored to, to visit Greece. Uh, I think a country that is blessed with uh, iconic and diverse natural sceneries. Um, I think Top of the agenda, of course, we have the European Green Deal and our climate action. And only last week, I think, the, the, the government really proposed an uh, ambitious package, uh, which we, of course, noticed. But the, the public discussions will, will only start. But I think it is very important the way that you take to see the Green Deal as an opportunity. Because what we're trying to, 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 to do is to show that the Green Deal is not a environmental legislation or climate legislation. It's a horizontal change which will affect uh, many, uh, many uh, different uh, areas. And of course, in that transition, we have to find a place to everyone. Uh, because the Green Deal can be only implemented if everyone is on board. If we leave someone behind, the Green Deal fails. And therefore, of course, uh, that just transition is at the heart of the Green Deal. Uh, I wanted to congratulate you, of course, on your ambition uh, on biodiversity. I was there in Marseille on your announcement, and especially about the Mediterranean Sea. I think this is something that is really dear to, 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 to your heart, uh, to, to, to Greek people's heart, and, and definitely there is a lot of work to be done in order to bring Mediterranean Sea to good and healthy status. Not only it will benefit, uh, you know, uh, the, the, the people, but it will also be a viable economic because the coastal communities, they depend on the healthy sea um, and not only on fisheries, but also um, tourism sector, which again was heavily hit by the COVID pandemic and of course it needs our, our, uh, our attention. Uh, I deeply value our cooperation. Uh, I think Greece and the European Commission are always working uh, in a very constructive manner uh, with, the, with the respective ministers. And of course, we take uh, very seriously all the matters. And you mentioned IUU fishing as well. I can reassure you that the Commission is doing everything we can. We raise this uh, issue multiple times, especially at the GFCM Council. Of course, there is certain things which we will be probably discussing, uh, discussing later on uh, what is the, 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 the major problems, but Commission is fully supporting Greece on, 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 on that matter.